busy night for police here in Chaco Bottom and the city of Richmond as they continue to investigate three separate shootings. We're still trying to figure out if these shootings are connected, but one business leader here in the community that I talked to say he heard it all. Business is back to normal here in Chaco Bottom, but in the overnight hours of Saturday morning, gunshots rang in the streets. We're hoping that this is not uh, you know, something that's going to be repeated. David Napier is the president of the Chaco Bottom Neighborhood Association. He also owns a restaurant next to the farmer's market and says he heard multiple shots. Well, I heard uh, one shot and then about a split second later, five or six in a rapid volley. And then about 15 minutes later, I heard more distant shots. Again, like five shots fired off. Richmond police say officers were called to the 1700 block of East Franklin Street just after 2 a.m. where they found a man shot with life-threatening injuries. Napier believes it happened near a nightclub on the street. It is a very safe neighborhood, 23 hours a day, most of the days of the week. But, uh, you know, occasionally at closing time on a Friday or Saturday night, you know, we have issues. About 15 minutes later, police say they were called for a two car accident along the 2200 block of East Main Street, where they found another man shot with life threatening injury. Bullets also rang out in Gilpin Court earlier Saturday morning after police say they found a man with a gunshot wound at the 1200 block of St. James Street. Meanwhile, in Shaco, Napier says it's concerning, but is hoping the new chief can help curb the gun violence. Especially with the changes and things, you know, I'm wondering what enforcement is going to look like, um, what it's going to look like down in Shaco Bottom. Now, police say that all three victims were transported to the hospital. Two of them were in critical condition. Anyone with information is asked to give police a call.